please watch the full video before disliking it. Assalamu alaikum everybody, I hope you guys are good in the hood. This video is like a skit and also a talking video. So I hope you guys enjoy this weird video. And by the way, it's about racism in different countries. I don't take this personal, it's just uh, my predictions of what people think when they first think of your country or you know it's just an insult to your country in a funny way I hope you guys don't take it seriously because I'm gonna insult my countries too so we're all good we're all one family one love one unity and please don't feel bad if your country isn't part of it it's like a roasting <laughs> a country I think this is like part one and there's it could be in parts different parts also so next time I could put another part for this video. Yo, where are you from? Pakistan. Pakistan? So that's why you smell like curry, isn't it? Yo, where are you from? Lebanon. You're from Lebanon? No wonder you have that weird Arabic dialect. Yo, where are you from? Egypt. You're from Egypt? You probably already think that's an insult. Yo, where are you from? Sudan. You're from Sudan? No wonder you have noodles hair. Yo, where are you from? Mexico. You're from Mexico? You probably smell like a taco with that stash of yours. Yo, where are you from? Morocco. You're Moroccan? You probably know how to do black magic. Oh, and I like that Atai Chai. Chai. Yo, where are you from? America. You're an American? No wonder you're obese. Yo, where are you from? Iraq. You're Iraqi? I probably could get some help with you fixing my car. Oh, and you look like a terrorist. Yo, where are you from? UAE. You're Emirati? No wonder you're so serious. Yo, where are you from? Saudi Arabia. You're Saudi? You probably drive on the wrong side of the road more than you driving on the right side. Yo, where are you from? Israel. You're Israeli? Oh, I'm sorry. That doesn't even exist on my map. Yo, where are you from? Palestine. You're Palestinian? Since everybody has weapons at home, yours is probably only rocks. Yo, where are you from? Turkey. You're from Turkey? Oh, I thought it was the rooster animal. Turkey. Yo, where are you from? Syria. You're Syrian? Make me a fake CD GTA game. Since you're a professional at doing fake things. Alright guys, so... I don't know if you guys like this video or you find it so insulting. My purpose isn't to insult anybody. I know I insulted some certain countries, people, but that's not the way you're supposed to judge people on where they come from. Pakistanis smell so good. It doesn't mean, just because Pakistanis eat curry, it doesn't mean that Pakistanis stink. Actually, there's Pakistanis, I'm sure, wallah, that are even cleaner than me. Just because you can't say a dialect in a certain way doesn't make you any less from another person. You Lebanese people are still good. Just because a lot of people insult the country, Egypt, and you might be offended by telling people that you're from Egypt, you shouldn't feel bad because you are special because that's how you were born. You should be proud of it. Just because you were born with curly hair like mine, but maybe curlier, doesn't make you any less you're still special if you're Sudanese with curly hair because that's who you are. Mexican people, como estas? Bien. I just want to tell you that just because you love tacos and Taco Bells and, have, and love having a big huge mustache doesn't make you any less than, than a normal human being. Because that's who you are, you gotta be special. Just because you're an American doesn't mean you're fat. And just because you guys like burgers doesn't make you any less than a human of another person. Just because you're Iraqi and you know how to do things the way that you do and you look like a terrorist doesn't mean it makes you special because you know how to do things that people don't know how to do even though they will use your advantage 
and might think of you like a poor guy for working such services but it's actually good and at the same time maybe you do look like a terrorist but it doesn't make you a terrorist just by looks because you know the terrorists are always the opposite of the the people who tell you things are usually the people who are that so yeah just because you're Emirati and you're serious maybe 98% of the time with your looks with your that's actually good because you're like a formal role model to the world and people love Emiratis all around the world you know you you have the straight uh, straight back like this and you love people you greet people to your country you treat them so well everything's good just because you're Saudi and you're unique you have different ways of doing things driving the wrong side is okay in Saudi Arabia doesn't make you less than another person actually makes you special because you're intelligent you know if like a car is gonna come or not and you instead of making that long turn you just make it here which is easier just because you're Israeli okay if you're Israeli you're not actually Israeli because I'm, I'm really sorry for this but it goes to a limit your country is actually not on the map like if you print a map in 19 20s or something before the Israelis came there's no such thing as Israel you guys originate from the UK and you guys should be proud of where you come from so if I was you I would just go back to the origins of your country it's no problem I mean it's okay just because you're Palestinian and you love Hamas all the time it's okay loving Hamas and having weapons as stones or rocks that's the only thing you have to protect yourselves and I support you guys so be happy and thumbs up for Palestine just because you're Moroccan you have long curly hair you have a beard you look kind of scary to the people the other day someone mentioned that I'm Moroccan and I laughed but it's okay I was happy actually just because you're Moroccan doesn't mean you do black magic and that's what I thought at first when I first knew about Moroccans I'm like Moroccans do black magic that's what I thought but it's not true. I met so many Moroccans, they're so sweet, they're so friendly, and they will invite you to their houses. That's what one of my teachers did. He invited me to his house in Morocco. He's like, inshallah, when you come, we will invite you, we can go have fun. And I'm like, okay, sounds good. And you guys love chai atai, chai atai, and it tastes good, I guess. You put sugar, I didn't put sugar, so. Just because you're from Turkey, and in English, they call the country Turkey, even though it's Turkia. Doesn't mean it's that rooster or that animal. Turkey, that they do, and Christians do celebrations with. You know, you guys are still good in this hood. And finally, just because you're creative with doing fake things as a Syrian. Now, I went to Syria, and I saw like these shops doing CDs, fake CDs, and I was actually happy. Because I could purchase cheaper CDs, even though it's wrong, but it's legal there. Just because you're creative, you guys could do like almost every job. You could create the job from zero to a hundred so quick. That makes you special too. So don't feel bad. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I know it was insulting. I'm really sorry if you're insulted. But I did solutions at the end telling you you're special. And you are special. Just because... You're from a certain country doesn't mean you're any less than another person. The people who judge on where you come from directly, like thinking, okay, you're from this country, you should be like this. They are the people who are lower than you because they're judging you on where you come from and how you look rather than judging you from what's in the hearts of yours. So don't feel bad. And I might do part two if you guys think this is good or I might just stop it. If I get like hate on this video so much, I'm just gonna stop this because I don't want to hurt anyone. But I think it's a good idea to show people what other people would think of you if you tell them where you're from. If you like this video, please like it. If you dislike it, please dislike it so I know if I should delete it. And also let me know if you thumbs it up. If I didn't mention your country or a country that you want me to say, let me know so I could do it next video. And those who dislike it, please watch the full video before disliking it. And I will go with you if you dislike it at the end. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment, subscribe. 
Hope to see you guys later. Peace in the Middle East. Love you all from all countries.